It seems that I am on my own. It's time to start planning again, but this time I will plan my sweet revenge. I will find those responsible, and I will make them suffer for what they did to me. To get the job done, I will need money, a lot of money. To this end, I have traveled to Nueva Esperanza, a promising island with only a handful of inhabitants. I will fill the island with the unwanted, oppressed, and desperate. I will guide them to redemption. With an island full of people, I will find a way to make money. Okay. Our president it def definitely does have a grand vision of uh, Nueva Esperanza. Uh, so all telephone hygienists expelled from Canada and mimes on the loose. They are silent but deadly. Okay. Let's go ahead. Forward all this. Forward, forward, forward. Uh, rise to power. This doesn't change. Oh, it does change stuff. Uh, let's see, religious. What else can we change? Hotel, corporate buyout. Ooh, two thousand dollars a year extra by the treasury. Installed by the KGB. Ooh, no, I like electors as socialists. Okay. Back. What does this do? Previous. Uh, does a minor? Yes, minor. That's what you want. Ten plus communists and ten plus. Ooh. What were, we, what were we before? Self-made man. Oh, that increases the 15 plus percent plus workers production. Okay, well then let's choose a minor then. Okay. Alright, that seems good. Change that up a bit, so hopefully this island is full of uh, mining resources. Presidente, you are truly a great and benevolent ruler for opening the doors of your beloved island to all who wish to find refuge. Thank you, Penultimo. I'm sure that Presidente can make uh, use of even the most desirable, undesirable people that come to Tropico. Let's wait and see what the cat is going to drag in. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. First, we're going to have to do that. Change the views a bit. Ooh. Nice little island we got going on. Well, something tells me maybe this time we're going to have a tsunami. Okay. Well. Firstly, before we get things done, let's go look for a mine. Oh, wow. That's good. Oh, we got two gold mines this up here. Tropical news today. Where, here? And I am your host, Penultimo, two, bringing you the two most iron. objective, pleasant, and politically correct news. Stay with us to learn the truth. As approved by El Presidente himself. Oh. Okay, unfortunately, we don't have any bauxite, it doesn't look like. No, no bauxite, which is, doesn't really make a difference. What I actually noticed as well, let's actually go to options, hotkeys, and. Ah, here we go, here we go, here we go. There's some actual extra um, things that they haven't uh, put onto the, uh, the user interface. So, I can't remember what they were. Oh, bunker. Let's put a bunker to Q. A bunkhouse. Let's put that to W. Uh, what else is there? A cement factory. Let's put that to E. Uh, what else? What else? What else is there? Eternal flame. Let's put that to R. T. Uh, what else? Yeah, so there's a couple of things that we've never seen before, which definitely does suck. Because they haven't, they, because this is only the first uh, release of the game, they haven't patched it or anything. Uh, let's see, what else can we use? Ministry Motel. I think everything else we've basically seen. Thankfully, they haven't uh, not included it, like really important things, but that looks like that's about it. Yeah, so let's go cancel, close. So let's go Q. No, I don't want that. Damn, I shouldn't have pressed cancel. Fire out, I'm a bastard. Let's go back to here. Bunker was Q. Bunkhouse, we'll put that to W. Bank bunkhouse is just a uh, normal building anyway. Uh, where else was there? There was the... Uh, oh god, I'm an idiot. There we go, let's put that to W, put that to E. 
There's something else, but... Oh, who cares? Okay. Let's do that. Bunker. So a bunker has is like a guard station, but with six people, soldiers that you can have, and an eternal flame. Oh, I have no idea what it does though. Nor do I have any idea of how much it's going to cost, but I can't really decide that anyway. So yeah, let's go to. No, we don't want farms. We want a mine because we are just that greedy that we just want a mine. Okay, let's put that mine right there. Uh, how's everything going? We don't have much tenants in our tenements. They Agent do. Sasha, I am happy that you were able to leave your super secret bunker in I'm Russia glad that you're in happy. order to join us. I'm glad that you're I have always wanted to ask you, what do you use to make your hair so shiny? Comrade Sonny, I am happy to be here among our brothers in Tropico to spread the light. Uh, so that's what they did. They only gave us obviously 30 people in our population now, which yeah. definitely does this is suck. Good but really, I'm Quite gonna a bit. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to set aside an immigration office and let's build it right there facing the water where all the immigrants are going to come from. President Ooh. Dante, my childhood fears have come to life. A group of 50 scary mimes is on their way to the island. Oh, here we go. They're going to... They're going to screw us over by making people die if we don't do certain things. That, that's that's realistic. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to build a cabaret. However, I do really want to build an immigration office and set it to open doors. And we don't have any workers, do we? Well, we've got a couple of houses as well that gave us. It's pretty cool. Okay, so it seems like our... Palace is, is the main place where people go to for work. Getting paid $10 an hour, or just one not $10, whatever. And then these wages are five, and that is six, shouldn't it be? No, oh, it's five, okay. So I picked up a new guy. All right. All right, if we still have 30, then this, yeah, this should be left. Less Don't one. worry. Okay. Thank you, Dex. Hurry up and build this so we can get more people. How's our Tempsters office going? It's got two people. Nice, nice. And our garage? It's got two people as well. That's pretty good. Okay. Definitely looking forward to this mission. So, well, I guess all we've got to do is start building up a bit of a mining industry and then we'll be all good to go. Hire a foreign worker. Don't have any high schools yet, obviously. What the hell is that guy doing just walking around? Buena tarde. What are you doing? Where are you from? Ghana. Is that Ghana? I think that's Ghana. We'll just say it's Ghana. Okay. Cabaret is nearly built, so we're not going to be losing any people by the end of the year, which is good to see. Okay, why, why am I just playing normal speed? We should play fast forwarded speed. Duh. Actually, let's cancel this. No, we can't. Too late now. No. Well. We're not going to have enough food to, to feed our own people soon. Which is obviously no good. We can't have that happening. Oh, come on. Build, build, build people. Build. Alright, maybe we should build a bit of a logging industry while we're at it. Yeah, I think that's what we should do. So, let's build a logging industry. Oh, but mines pay so well. And we can afford just to do mines. So, I think, I'm thinking of just doing mines. To be completely honest right now. As always, that's all we're doing here right now. In our missions, but... Uh, cabaret is not built yet. There we go. There comes a worker. There we go, it's built. Presidente, I hope you have good legal counsel as a group of eight freshly fired lawyers are heading towards our island. Well, they're smart and have a college to but they're truly evil in nature without a doubt. 
The vile presence will have a detrimental effect on Chopkins and provoke one person to become a rebel each year. Have no fear, President, as I have a device, a special program to turn them back to the good side. We must start by building a grade school and exposing the lies to the antics of small children and it will to melt their stone hearts. So, one person becomes rebel each year until the lies are re-educated. Build a grade school, grade school to, uh, to initiate Penultimate's plan. Well, it really should be my plan because I, after all, I am El Presidente. But, whatever. Whatever. It's all good with me. Oh, when's our next... Oh, shit, come in. There we go. Sorry, it's already here. And we're not going to be making enough money, are we? Nope, not this time. We're going to be quite... Oh, actually, we're going to get foreign aid. We can actually get a lot of foreign aid. Hopefully. Well, our grade school is being built. There we go. We've got about 8,000 extra dollars. Yep, 8,700 or so dollars. Good to see, good to see. Our grade school is nearly built and we do need it. Wow. Okay, we need to build a new tenement. Definitely need to build a new tenement. We can't build two though, because we don't have enough money, unfortunately. Oh wow, we've got a population of 90 people now. How many people did that... What? How many people did you let in? Where's the immigration office? And that only supposedly attracted seven people. Okay. Okay. Alright, good to see we're going to have a flourishing mining industry then. Well, we're going to have a flourishing With industry and everything. Of a high school in Tropical, wow. I would like to remind all students of the consequences of misdemeanors in school. Attempted murder of a classmate. <laughs> Spanking. Successful murder of a classmate. <laughs> Spanking. Becoming a rebel and blowing up the school. Meeting with the school counselor. Assassinating El Presidente, right? I will not kill Presidente again. One hundred times. <laughs> okay. Miss Pineapple is definitely a bit of a, a bit on the crazy side, I gotta admit. I have to build that this way. There we go. Like that. There we go. Now I can continue building up this way. There we go. Okay. So now we got a, a new mine being built. Starvation took 13 victims last year. Wow. Damn. We're going to start earning a bit more money then, people. Get your act together. $3,300 of export revenue. Come on. Get more teamsters in. Yes, yeah, 6000 Okay. Good to see that going back up. Okay. $3,000 left. We've got to build some uh, food food for the people. Build a bit of bananas. So, oh, we can't build bananas, can we? Papaya. This seems like the perfect spot for the papaya. All right. At least the people have food. So they can eat something. Uh, why is no one here? Make the rent free. That is just how awesome we are. Actually, let's just increase it. But oh, oh. Okay. Oh, we got two builders here. Wow, one builder. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, we're going to have to start building some more things. We've already built a grade school. What are you talking about? Presidente. I hope. Oh wait, that's a high school. Yeah, I'm an idiot. Oh, yeah. I'm such an idiot. Truly such an idiot. Comrade Presidente. Okay, we have too many shacks, etc., etc. Who wants to build a tenement? There you go. There you go. Oh, I was tempted to build another one, and we're going to build another one. No me interesa. Don't you think there are too many homeless people on the island, Penelope? No, I don't actually. Yes. If there were a single homeless person in Tropical, I would personally build him his very oh, own shack. We're not getting, yeah, be getting much money. A, shack. a home is a home is a home, Sonny. Today's shack is a home. It's actually check out uh, our foreign right? relations. There we go. 
Ooh, your relationship with the US are going down. In debt and oriented towards communism. Aren't we all? What are you guys talking about? Well, we are setting up a thriving uh, mining industry, so I don't know what they're complaining about. Obviously, mining de definitely does give us as much money as we possibly can ha get. Uh, we're going to have to start expanding up this way for these gold mines and stuff. Because there's four iron mines and two gold mines. We're going to make good use out of everything. Got to buy a queen first. Before we get start getting too much ahead of ourselves though. Actually, how's our oh yeah, starvation puts on taking people? That's no good. Oh wow, is that papaya? There's more papaya over there. Alright, and this is corn. A bit more corn. As long as you're feeding the people, I don't care. Starvation is taking its toll over seventeen thousand dollars with twenty-seven new immigrants. Fantastic. All right, build a church right there. Build a clinic right here, and we're back in debt. How quick our money goes. Tsk, tsk, tsk. Oh, oh. Presidente, our plan is working, and the heartless lawyers are beginning to become more docile. Oh, good stuff. Uh, to turn them into real model citizens, we must enroll them in my specially designed sweater knitting class. Unfortunately, my stock of yarn has arrived a bit short, and I need Presidente to produce and export 500 llama wool in order to replenish it. No person can remain with an evil soul after knitting a fluffy sweater. Export 500 llama wool for the knitting class. The reward lawyers should become re educated and stop becoming rebels. Okay. We've got to do that for Penultimo then. We've got to build a ranch with llamas. Where do llamas want to live? Up here? In the middle of nowhere? That's cool. That's cool. That's totally cool. Okay. Our uh, shacks aren't being built too quickly, are they? Not at all. Which is no good. Uh, but I'm going to have to end this episode. We don't want to keep them too long. And we're having a bit of problems with the uh, black screens during rendering, which really sucks. I'll try to fix that up for you guys. But until next time, see ya.